it's Earth 1111, it's Roxanne. So the energies right now are just so strong. We've anchored in so many new templates. And a lot of people are going to be feeling that just huge doubt, that self-doubt, that what are they doing? Why are they not feeling like they're on their path? What are they doing in life? What is their purpose? And even people that have been following their intuition, following their guidance, are rarely feeling the push against what they've been doing, this doubt that what is the whole point? Why are we feeling that so much right now? The reason is your ego comes up. The stronger the breakthrough you're about to go through, the stronger the greatness you're about to achieve, the more change you're creating in your life, the stronger the ego is going to come up to really try to stop that momentum. R remember, the ego is any part of you that is limited. The ego is an aspect that's been walled off from source. It only has its own little identity. And it doesn't like change. Those parts of you that like stagnant energy, that like to just keep the same thing going because that's all it knows. Every part of you that's walled off is a part of the ego. And every single part of the ego only knows its own little tiny identity and what it believes to be true. And it believes that anything out of the little tiny box that it exists in is completely scary. So it will try anything to try to come up in you to bring you that doubt to make you feel like what are you doing it will try to put a stop to the amazing changes that's going on right now so the more you're trying to push through the more you're you're just so close to a breakthrough the stronger you're gonna feel this ego pushing against you in every way trying to stop the more you're gonna feel the ego in every way trying to stop your forward momentum. It doesn't like change, it wants to stay the exact same. It likes what it knows. This comes from within you and it also is manifested in your reality because everything from within is also outside of yourself. So you might see obstacles coming up, you might see, you might have that resistance inside yourself. But the ego will try anything to prevent the change from happening. And the change is imminent. We are going through massive changes, not just personally, not just in your microcosmic aspects, but in the macrocosm, in the collective, in the universe. Change is the only thing that's constant right now. So the stronger you're feeling that doubt, the closer you are to the breakthrough. So it's just like that saying, it's darkest before dawn. Really try to hold on your path. Try to really create the new. Try every day to just spend a lot of your time trying to do new things. Trying to push through that resistance. Because every time that you push through and you don't allow the ego to control the outcome or control your behavior, the ego gets a little smaller, so every part of, of, of yourself gets a little bit more healed and connected to the whole, which is God's source energy light. So really try to not allow that resistance to overtake you. You know, if you feel like crying, if you feel like having a, a freak out, do it. Get it out of your system, get these energies moving out. If you feel that blockage, really try to push through, try to exercise, you know, try to sing, dance, play, have fun, you know, watch some funny videos, just really try to push through these, these energies that will try anything to stop your forward momentum into your new life. Because these new realities are based on complete love and alignment to your true soul, your true heart's dream. And like I said, because our energy creates and pulls to us realities in our outside world, you'll also see obstacles. 
So if you're seeing the same obstacle over and over and over, well, ask yourself, is it because I'm not meant to be doing that? Is that not my true path? Really follow your guidance right now, your intuition. It, but if you're seeing that resistance in the outside world, those obstacles, those challenges, it could just be that your ego is pulling that towards yourself to really try to stop that, that momentum. So really try to figure out the difference. Is this obstacle, is this challenge trying to put me on a new path, trying to show me new opportunities? Or is this challenge just simply something to break through? So really right now, the energies of June are fast momentum. We're essentially streamlining into our new life. We've anchored us grid keepers and gatekeepers have anchored an, yet another new template. A very strongly organic template, which is the truth, the way that the world, the universe essentially should be existing from. So everyone's going to really see fast momentum, fast change. So look for those opportunities, push through that resistance. And if you're feeling that the door keeps shutting on what you're trying to do, really see is that closing for something better to open up to me. Ask yourself, start questioning everything and you will start seeing that this doubt, which is pushing so hard, starts to, to dissipate and you start being able to generate the breakthrough, which is what we're all starting to create. So when you push through over and over and you really stay on the course, if the course is for your highest aligned truth of your soul, you will break through. June is the month of really accelerated breakthroughs. So really push through that resistance. Don't believe that self-doubt. Really try to honor yourself and follow your guidance. And look for new opportunities as well, because if it, one door closes, another one always opens. We'll see you soon on Earth 1111. Thanks.